Hey, what's up, guys? Camp and Rusher here. You know if I'm coming at you late, it means we got big news. Everything's leaked. Someone's got an inside source. Somehow, everything is leaked. The map, the battle pass, photos, the full key art. We got so much to talk about, I'm just going to jump right into it. So first, let's start with the big one. Here is an early look at the Chapter 4 Season 5 map. Whether the name of it is OG season five, not too sure. Gonna let you look at it. This is a the, this image was taken in game using version 27. So this should be our first initial map once the season launches again, presumably uh, November 3rd, right? Around uh, downtimes around 2 a.m. Eastern could be five, six, seven a.m. Eastern when the uh, new season goes live. So what do we what do we think? I don't see Polar Peak, but keep in mind it could be frozen over potentially, right? It, it all just depends on the timeline of all this. We do have a lot of information about how the map changes are going to work a little bit later in the video. So stick around. We're going to start with the massive stuff, which is obviously map, like I just showed you, um, and then uh, battle pass right away, and then go from there. So it, with the teasers that were by Epic, obviously this is not an Epic announcement. This is an inside leak from FNBR Intel and Stream FNBR. Somehow they've got access to this stuff. And this is where we were at, right? We had one new teaser posted earlier today, and it, it was this shot, and then that made the full image of them together. Well, uh, that's, that, that's the highest quality you're going to get, but here is the entire image unlocked. Uh, and th this is the best quality we have. So, I mean, apologies, but at the same time, we are seeing it early. So I'm not complaining, right? And yeah, we, we, we've unlocked a, a few other things. We did have a lot of the pieces already. Uh, a couple things I noticed right away are driftboard confirmed, right? Ho hoverboard confirmed, tactical shotgun confirmed this t this stuff was probably going to be officially teased anyways tomorrow by epic so we're getting it about 12 to 16 hours early uh, also i'm going to remind you right now subscribe turn your noties on i might have another video up tonight there's still more leaks dropping as i'm making this video so y you're going to want to sub lots of stuff coming and let's go ahead and keep showing you more the battle pass Here's a better look at next season's Battle Pass skins. And again, low quality. Don't worry. It gets better than that. The Some of the names we have, some of the names for the skins. Spectra Knight was the combination. We actually thought the it was a male Black Knight combined with the Ice King. It's actually a girl. Spectra Knight is the name of it. We'll show you photos in a second. Renegade Lynx, uh, Dark Storm is a style. And then Omega Rock and Harbinger Armor is another style. Let's start with the Harbinger Armor. Uh, Omega Rock. There it is. Pretty good shot here for you. Uh, obviously, that's a Battle Pass page. It looks, it's a mean looking skin, man. It's a real mean looking skin. Love the look of it. It, it, it says reach level 42, 46, so it's around that um, around that level of, of the Battle Pass. Here's another look at one of the styles connected to that Omega Rock skin. Love the name. Fits perfect. Th this is up there for one of my favorites that we've seen so far. But I don't know if it can compete with the Spectra Knight. Check this out. This is the, I, I believe this is Spectra Knight with Galaxy. Like, yeah, it's the Galaxy style. Look at all the styles you can get with this skin. Like this skin was already probably gonna be my favorite. And then you look at the amount of customizability attached to it, wow. This battle pass is going to slap, ladies and gentlemen. They've done such a good job with it. Uh, a quick reminder when we're on the topic, where is Rusher shameless self-promotion? Here it is. Code the camp and Rusher. Type it in for me right now so you don't forget. It goes a long way. If it's not me, type someone else in there. Uh, let's keep showing you more, though. While, while, while I'm promoting myself, let, let's show you another look at one of the other styles, right? I guess that's like the golden look. Like, like this skin is just going to be so good. I don't know if there'll be a skin that, that comes out that's better than this, right? It's got the nostalgia point, popular mix of, of you know, famous OG skins, and, and then throw in, I don't know how much you can scroll up, but like, I, I feel like there's even more color styles than what we see in that initial shot. Yeah, I was looking around at, at more leaks coming out and, and there's no other uh, previews of other styles. So this is what we got. Also, I should mention that the battle pass is just called the, the OG pass. Even better, man, even better. So that's my favorite. We're not done yet though. We've got to look at Renegade Lynx. 
And this looks to be, yes, level 22. Reach level 22, 18 to 22 in the battle pass to unlock this. There is a, a style. Yes, here it is. Dark Storm Renegade Lynx is attached to this. I love the Dark Storm style. I really do. Big fan. And leak that just came out like two minutes ago is from, again, FNBR Intel. Who knows? I, I have no idea where they got this stuff. Ho hopefully we find out because I'm so curious. The This battle pass, as we thought here on the channel, will only have 50 tiers. And we've got to look at, at how the UI is going to look. There's a shot for you. So, yeah, it looks like five skins. Five skins total rather than eight and 50 levels right so a uh, half of what we usually have but we we have less than half of the time so you're gonna have to grind unless they calibrate the xp appropriately to you know to make it the same speed as as we would expect to reach level 50 normally right or to, to complete the battle pass on time for the same number of players that usually do if that makes sense so, yeah, that's Battle Pass stuff. Stick around. There's still a ton more because Stream FNBR, who, uh, again, it was kind of the two guys here that had the information, he then did a Q&A, right? People could ask him questions. He answers. As, again, somehow he knows how all this is how all this is going to work I, I i'm so i mean i'm happy about it just a little confused so let's go through some of the questions he was being asked okay the, the tack shotgun confirmed like i said we just saw that in the photo at the start and then the the hoverboard and, and then again we know a lot of other stuff but i did talk about that in a previous video so it, we'll, we'll we'll talk more about kind of everything over the next couple of days but let's talk about more of the new stuff the next season of Fortnite will not have a new Battle Pass UI. It will still use the same star system as we have been using for a while now, right? We kind of know that just because we've seen the images, but confirming. Hoverboards returning next season. We already knew this one as well. Here's a big one. The map will be changing every update with different seasons slash POIs. The image I provided earlier may be 27.1 or 27.2. So he did say in that initial shot, it was from the same guy where I showed off the map. Here's another look at it. He did say this was using version 27. He says that's, uh, I guess he's going back on it here a little later. It could be one of the later updates. Uh, keep in mind that in the files right now, the, the updates we have are 27, the initial launch of next season. 27.1 will be the first downtime update. And then 27.11 is attached to the live event, uh, probably the final update of the OG season. So uh, uh, this has been my confusion from the start, right? We, we think we're cycling through six different seasons of Fortnite, but how do you do that amount of map changes in such a short time? It, it, it's uh, he says every update but we only know about really one major downtime update and then one update focused on the event so maybe they add all the stuff in to just uh, update without downtime right at the start we will have the answers i'll be live streaming that night november 3rd november 2nd evening and we will know the answers to this question right away right probably before downtime even ends but we're probably just going to have to wait till then to i guess confirm how the timeline's going to work with map changes are there any b battle pass collaborations right oh, we've seen the five skins is there a secret skin we don't know if there's a secret skin he doesn't answer that part but he says all skins are original we've got no collabs confirmed i'm all for it man i'm all for it another big one og graphics question mark he says sort of you'll have to figure that out out and this one kind of makes sense we did talk about it in the video earlier today it for sure has the grass the foliage of chapter four right we've got the the flowers the updated ground basically does that mean the entire map is chapter four graphics not necessarily but at least some of it is and it, it seems like he's confirming that here and then we got a question is there going to be a 3d lobby and he says no 3d lobby and then talks about again uh og graphics sort of but improved is his answer to that so that's all i got thanks for watching touch the like button subscribe we're gonna have more more stuff is dropping take care talk soon goodbye